Hey YouTube friends, welcome back to my channel. It's Artie Artie here. I hope you're having a good day. Now in front of me is another addition to my Rainbow High collection and she is none other than Jade Hunter. I got her from Amazon at about 20 US dollars or so after a discount from $26.99 which is her original price but shipping and all of that to Malaysia where I live will still cost a lot of money so let's take a look at the box itself before we remove her from the packaging on top you can see that it is written her name Jade Hunter from series 1 at the side of the box, you can see that she comes with a second outfit and also at the bottom, it's her second pair of shoes and right under J, you can see that it's her graphic image together with other Series 1 doll collection and I'm always amazed by the packaging because at the corner, it is of a cylinder shape here. And at the back of the box, it's a full image of all the doll collection from Series 1 of Rainbow High. The message at the bottom of the box explains that these girls are from Rainbow High, the fashion school. Without any further ado, let's unbox her and take a closer look at her beauty. So Jade Hunter comes with these two cute hangers. One doll stand which is green in color and sparkly, just like the hair brush or I call it a comb. And it's written here rainbow. Out from the box, this is how Jade Hunter looks like. So let's take a closer look at her from the top till the bottom. Jade comes with a woven green beanie. On camera, it's slightly lighter but in person, it is of this very beautiful shocking green. And then we move on to her eyebrow. She's got light brown eyebrow and it matches with the color of her eye makeup which is of a mixture of brown and also light green sparkles. She's got green eyes and she uses a nude lipstick. Her skin has this pearly finish Somehow, I noticed that her eyes are of different color. On the right, it's slightly bluish and on the left, it's slightly greenish. She also comes in this green earring, which not all of the Series 1 dolls has it. Onto her clothes, she comes in this green jacket with gathers at the end of her sleeve and also at the back of the jacket as well. At the front of the jacket, it has this faux zipper and a drawstring in front. Under her green jacket, it's a black t-shirt top which is written NT Sparkle Sparkle Club with the green heart shape drawn on top of the words which velcros at the back and on the bottom it's her shorts which has some wordings on it one says Hollywood some says sparkle all over hashtag And there's a functioning drawstring over here. And she comes in this very cute sneakers which is written rainbow. And the soles are pink so it makes it very special. Also if you take a closer look you can see that it is transparent. 
Now let us take a look at her beautiful green hair. So as you can see, she comes with big curls, but at the back it is tied in this manner, which I am going to cut off the hair tie. And it has a lot of hair gel at the back, which I also plan to wash out her hair. Other than that, the curls over here are very soft in actual fact. I really really love the color of her hair because if you are seeing personally, her hair is actually not all green. There are some streaks of light green and also white so the mixture creates a lot of depth onto her hair. So yeah, she is really really a gorgeous doll to me. And I've changed her into her second outfit, so let's take a look at the first piece. This is her jacket. It's light green and it has pocket details with full zipper at the front. And also buckle details on the pocket. This ribbon over here is written rainbow. However, it is sewn together, so I am unable to open the pocket. There is also some black piece of material detail sewn over here. Overall, I would say that this is a very, very cute piece of jacket. And I really like it so much. And let's take a look at her pants. It's a combination of light green, black, and also white stripes. And it's written rainbow high on the sides, both left and right. There's some gathers at the bottom over here. And also on around the waist. And let's move on to her footwear. It's a combination of white and pastel green. Also, there are green straps all over it with studded on top of the straps. And obviously, you can see that the sneakers are flat, but they are designed for feet which stands on an incline. In terms of articulation, she's able to turn her head left and right. Not quite up and down. And on her arms, she's able to bend it like this, back and forth, straight on. And she's able to touch her hair as well. And her wrist is able to bend inwards and outwards. For legs, there is an upper thigh movement. She's able to bend her knees as well up to this point and she's able to kick it backwards and also forward but there is no ankle movement at the bottom here and let me just show you the comparison of colors between Jade Hunter and Karma because prior to me getting Jade Hunter, I wasn't too sure about the color. I didn't want a repeat of a same color. However, because of the discount on Amazon, like I mentioned to you earlier, I got her and I noticed that they are of very different green shades. So like I've mentioned to you earlier, although the sneakers are flat, but it is designed for inclined feet, so dolls like Karma can wear them too. And there you have it, the full review of Jade Hunter from Series 1 of Rainbow High. In my opinion, I think she's really worth the buy because she comes with so many pieces of accessories and outfit in the entire package. And I really think she's a very gorgeous doll. So I hope you enjoy watching this video. Thank you very much. Please do like, share and subscribe for more contents like this. And I will see you in my next video. Bye for now and take care.